tracking device is in here somewhere, which means Bane is likely in here as well. Project TN1. Looks like Bane's experimenting with a new form of venom. Whatever it is, it must be what caused the physiological changes I saw in the corpse back at the GCPD. Some of this research is dedicated to overcoming his own addiction and It is said that which does not kill you makes you stronger. But that which makes you stronger can often kill you. Addiction is a weakness, one that must be overcome. Venom has become my addiction, my weakness. To free myself, I have tried many things. For a time, I sought to eradicate Venom and wipe those who manufacture it from the face of the Earth. But lately, I've gravitated towards Project TN1, a replacement drug which would eliminate Venom's addictive properties and holds the promise of a permanent effect. If it works, I would no longer have need of the delivery system. Another weakness. While early tests had to be terminated immediately, the latest subjects seem at least physically stable. But side effects are severe. Immediate and permanent long-term memory loss, followed by a general degradation of brain function that leaves the subject primitive. Testing continues. The latest formula shows promise. Once I have eliminated the bat, I will dedicate myself to finding a suitable volunteer for my tests. End of recording. Dependency on Venom, he can't survive without it. Impressive work, but it looks like Bane hasn't found a way to counter the damaging side effects this compound has on the brain's memory centers.